Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. We are still busy with fertilizers, and we were discussing that in order to gain uh, fertilizers, we have to create certain salts like ammonium nitrate, potassium nitrate, etc. And in order to do that, how do we get the nitrates? We have to create certain chemicals. And the first chemical we're going to create and, and look at the industrial process is ammonia today. And the ammonia process is called the Haber process. So what happens if you look here, nitrogen goes into a liquid separator and how do they do this? Liquid separator, they take the nitrogen and they cool it to minus maybe 178 degrees Celsius or more. And what happens is when A cools down, it becomes a liquid. And this is called a fractional distillation of A. What we're talking about here is that um, basically nitrogen and oxygen will, will, will liquefy at different, uh, at different temperatures. And at a particular temperature, the nitrogen will liquefy. And at a particular temperature, the oxygen will liquefy. And the liquid oxygen is removed and then the liquid nitrogen is left and the liquid nitrogen is taken down further then on the other side you receive by the electrolysis of water hydrogen and oxygen are formed the oxygen is removed and the hydrogen comes down into the ammonia reactor and the reaction that takes place here is nitrogen plus hydrogen to create ammonia and you have to balance it and to plus 3H2 give you 2NH3 and then under, we see it's at uh, 300 to 550 degrees Celsius and, and very high 25 megapascals and at high pressure we see we get a separator and whatever is waste is removed and we end up with our ammonia. So this is important that the Haber process takes place when nitrogen reacts with hydrogen to form ammonia. So that is our first uh, process that we uh, are discussing today. The next process we are looking at, okay, we don't need this whole diagram, but it's basically the reaction of the, the creation of nitric acid. Uh, the Oswald process refers to the manufacture of nitric acid. The Haber process, as mentioned earlier, manufactures ammonia. So the Haber process manufactures ammonia and the Oswald process manufactures nitric acid. So in order to know the, the process of nitric acid, you have to learn your equations very well. So you basically get NH3 plus uh, O2 gives you, if you look here, NH3 plus O2 will give you NO plus H2O and this takes place in the process in the presence of a catalyst now this is very confusing here but basically okay we, we're not going to go look at all those processes but if you look at ammonia reacts with you get ammonia here and then you react with oxygen here and you get nitric oxide which we're going to look at. But what happens in this particular case, we're just basically looking at this here. In the second step, the NO that is formed reacts with oxygen to form NO2. And in the third step, the NO2 reacts with water to form HNO3 plus NO. So that is the three reactions that are necessary in terms of the Oswald process. Just to balance the equation here now, if you have it NH3, you have to learn your balancing numbers, and there's no shortcut to that. 4 NH3 reacts with 5 O2 to form 4 NO plus 6 H2O, and then you get 2 NO plus O2 for 2 NO2, and then 3NO2 plus H2O forms 2NH3 plus NO. And this NO again goes and is recycled. This NO is recycled in the second step to react with more, oxy uh, with more oxygen to form 
uh, NO2 and the NO2 comes back to react with water to form NH3. So this diagram is basically a combination of the Oswald process with the Hamer process. If you just look at it, you're getting your gas separator, you're getting your nitrogen there, and here by the electrolysis, the, the you, you, electrolysis of water, oxygen is formed, the hydrogen comes through there, so we're going to get our NH3 that's going to form here, and the, all that oxygen that, they, that we created by the electrolysis and by the liquid fractional distillation of air, that oxygen that is formed, comes down and reacts with the ammonia in this reactor in the presence, presence of a platinum catalyst under high temperature and pressure to form NO2 and then it reacts with water in here to form nitric acid. So that's also an important aspect. So here basically we've created ammonia by the Haber process and nitric acid by the Oswald process. Now, we will just stop there for now and in our next lesson we will discuss the contact process and where the three processes are used in the manufacture of fertilizing. Thank you for your time.